The scope of artificial intelligence is the scope of this universe. AI will support each and every domain. AI will become a mentor, a buddy for students. Maths is going to be a very critical part when it comes to AI specific courses. That algorithm development will depend on your mathematic acumen also. We have started incorporating AI in each domain now. AI is going to support data engineering. AI is going to impact cyber security in a big way. So AI would come in everywhere. There are 13 specializations right now running in the campus, BTEC CSE program program in which uh, along with all the other specializations at basic and intermediate level there's a specialization where you can opt for AI and machine learning six to seven specialized courses in AI ML AI and data engineering uh, then we have uh, another program which is uh, generative AI with Microsoft AI ML specialization program which is a complete specialization degree data science data engineering a machine intelligence and uh, analytics program which is with quantify in mtech we only have one program which is mtech artificial intelligence as specialization the program with uh, uh, Intel, which is uh, IoT and AI analytics. But if I talk about the other programs, which is data science and data engineering will transfer, uh, then there's cyber security and blockchain, and then there is full stack uh, software development. All of them also have flavors of AI in it. Nomenclature might sound air, might not sound air, but AI is there in every program. And there's one common course which is there for the entire university when it comes, which is ethical use of AI. Because with AI, people need to also understand the guardrails. We have bisected the understanding, development and implementation comes to core engineering courses of CAC. How do you embrace AI is being taught to the entire university with respect to their domain. So there's a good amount of server resources available in the campus and good amount of, I would say, computing resources to be exact available in campus for students to work with it. There's an NVIDIA DGX 100 server, which has a very huge capacity when it comes to training AI model. If you have already developed an AI model, testing it, running it, 